St. Usha associations based in the United Kingdom have rallied to support the development of youth cricket in St. Usha, a promise made during the 16th Biennial Convention of the Union of St. Usha Overseas Associations in July 2014 has been fulfilled. Today, the 90 cricketers participating in a grassroots cricket program in the north have much-needed cricket gear. We have details in this report from Bernard Fannis. The promise to support the Northern Cluster Grassroots Cricket Program was made by Bertram Leon, the president of the Union of St. Lucia Overseas Associations. He visited the Grassroots Cricket Program based at the Bosage Cricket Ground and promised assistance upon his return to the UK. This is the result of his mobilization efforts. 16 bags of cricket gear sourced and donated by the Grosley Association in the UK and the National Committee for the St. Lucia Hurricane Relief Project, also in the UK. Help also came from nationals resident there. On hand to donate the 16 bags of cricket gear was one of the pioneers of the Grosley Association in the 1970s. His son, Len Leon, spoke on his behalf. We are extremely blessed to have with us today one of the pioneers of the Grosley Association UK back in the 70s, Mr. Leonard Kerry Leon. I have no doubt that the current president, as to myself would be honored if Mr. Leon would come forward to present the equipment. Len Leon says the UK associations hope to continue supporting youth development programs in St. Lucia. We hope to continue supporting the program seen as an important platform for the development of our young cricketing talented youths. We remain optimistic that we will unearth more Darren Sammies or future cricket stars by our contribution. Yeah, on behalf of the Northern Cluster Grassroots Cricket Program, we'd like to thank the UK Association. We'd like to tell them that we greatly appreciate this, this um, gesture and for sure we'll put the game in good use. Um, I know my, my group here, we're very, very grateful. And I know for sure at the end of the day, we, we're going to really um, do well. And it's going to inspire the youngsters to, to, to do well because we struggle sometimes with gear. And um, to see such beautiful stuff here, some lovely bats, pads and stuff, I'm sure um, they'll carry us a long way in terms of our future development. Coach Crafton was grateful for the donation of gear which included cricket bats, balls, pads, gloves, helmets, stumps, sweaters and other cricket accessories. This is Bernard Fanis reporting for the CTV News.